I thought the spring statement just showed the government were completely out of touch with what people are going through. And then you listen to rubbish that you hear there from Downing Street today. It has to be a team effort. What the hell do they mean by that? Absolute rubbish. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> absolute rubbish. I mean, it's got to be said, it's absolute rubbish. I think he's completely out of touch. Morris is completely out of touch, so getting other people to be in touch. We're also seeing in the statistics that... You know, sort of nine out of ten people are seeing this change mm. in their cost of living, and one in ten aren't. Well, it's the one in ten who are making the decisions. Mm. As far as I can see, it's ten percent of people making the decisions that they just don't understand. Yeah. Well, look, you're talking about the, the bigger problem looming on the horizon in the autumn. The, the plus side to that, I suppose, is we've got summer coming. We've got this opportunity to use less energy, but equally to try and come up with some solutions to this. It does look as though the government are trying to address it. Hi. What would you like are to they well, address it? Having this brainstorming well, session. Well, but we're all in it together. Yeah, look, just, how how does that affect somebody? It doesn't affect anybody with their grocery bills. It doesn't they're affect them with their with energy policy, bills, yeah. with their petrol bills. You talk about the summer. People like to go to the seaside in the summer. They like to have a day out, whatever it is. They're stuck in their homes now. They just, they simply, if you're on 25 grand a year, 30 grand, 40 grand a year, and prices are going up through the roof, you're not getting an increase. Your no, salary? Absolutely, absolutely. And when they when the government gives you it with one hand, they take it away with yeah. another, and it's complicated. It's not helping vulnerable people at all. There just isn't enough help out there. You know, all the consumer experts out there were just saying we've run out of ideas. There's just you know, it's quite insulting now to sort of say to people, you can save a little bit here, you can save a little bit here. It's actually hundreds of pounds. Yes. And those little apps and little things are not gonna not gonna help people. We need to see something like the windfall tax. On, on the energy companies. Big and bold, Big something and bold, decisive. You know, when the government is saying, oh, they need, they need that money to reinvest in, in renewables and, and all of that, it's, it's rubbish when you're seeing, actually, that money's going into shareholders' pockets. Mm. So it's all very well saying they need it to invest it. Well, they're not, so if they're not going to invest it, put it back into the pockets of the public and help them. Yeah.